CSMS Magazine this week has chosen two more books as our best pick of the week. And before I get to the names, I just want to remind you, we need your support to keep this rubric going. And I am pleading with our friends, in particular, in particular friends from Twitter, to contribute to this rubric. So if you have a friend or if you have a book, you would like the book to be reviewed and also be part of this small weekly competition, you can always also let me know or let us know. So uh, without further ado, here it is. Pick number one is title General Son, My Brother. It's a wonderful uh, gut wrenching novel. It's a classic that has been translated in more than 50 languages. It was written in 1956 by a Haitian author by the name Jack Stephen Alexis. And this book was originally uh, published in French and also uh, was released uh, by one of the most prestigious uh, publishing houses in Europe, Maison Gallimard. And years later, it was translated into English by Professor Carol Court from Manhattan, upstate New York, a uh, professor of comparative literature. Again, so that's General Son, my brother. So the next book is a book written by a guy named Ardain Isma, and it's titled Alicia Maldonado, A Mother Lost. This book was written yeah, a little bit, you know, some time ago. But for some reason, the committee last week is choosing this book as one of the pick for this week. And the main reason they say it's because of the of its multicultural uh, uh, undertone that actually, you know, uh, makes the book so lively when you read it. So uh, the third book, it's titled Broken by Dr. Mayoshi Gordon. She's one of our friends from uh, our Twitter writing community. It's a gut-wrenching memoir. Uh, years, uh, weeks ago, we had a conversation. She was one of my guests and the conversation. We had such a wonderful, you can always check it, Mayoshi Gordon and the author is Broken. Good read, want to start reading it. You certainly would not want to put it down. Again, Broken. So the last book is a fantasy uh, novel titled Unprecedented Times, written by Lisa Thomas, who is my guest this week from, from uh, England. And it's a book that I recommend every one of you should read because this is the first novel I'm read about the uh, conditions that we're living in. It's, it's, it's a, it's a uh, fiction uh, based on the pandemic. Very, very gut wrenching. So, Unprecedented Times is the fourth uh, book, and also the book that constitutes actually uh, uh, the main portion of the, this book pick of the week. Again, uh, please leave us a comment if you think that this would be, would, you know, worth to continue. Let us know. And if you truly believe in literature, also just let us know, because that's all we do in this branch also, just like the conversation, just like this section, this rubric, it's just a little baby of the conversation. We believe in literature, we believe in that fiction reflects reality of life. So let us know, and if you do like it, I would also recommend that you subscribe to this, yeah, uh, to this YouTube channel. And if you do subscribe, don't forget to click the notification bell. So that way, every time a video is posted, it will go directly into your portable. Again, until next time, bisous, bisous.